uh, with surface generation. I have some uh, pre-simulated uh, simulations here. Uh, each of these was run in software, uh, so it took a long time to generate. But the amount of physics that you see here is equivalent to what I showed you with the real-time uh, demo. So once we have surface generation in the hardware, you'll be able to run simulations that look like these. Uh, some of these are still sprite-based, but we have some uh, surface generations here. So this will be pretty exciting. Uh, you know, pause the simulation, have your matrix style effect. Show how the surface is generated. Now, even though these are all individual droplets, this would still be a single rendered mesh. Even sprite generation gives you some pretty interesting looking effects. Things like snow and fog and so on. Now note we have a, an emitter uh, creating the fluid particles, but we also have drains that you can uh, define. So if we look at this water example again, uh, as the water enters these shapes, uh, we're actually able to remove particles from the simulation as well. I showed that already. 